Hey y'all, I'm Spider Mom 1978. Okay, so this is Perdita. This is one of my Nandu Chromatis slings. Let's see if Perdita will eat. Well done, baby doll. Good job. Good job. Look at that beautiful baby. Oh my goodness. Look at that baby. Good job, Perdita. All right. Let's see who's next. Okay, so next we have... The Indochrysella olivaceae, also known as the Tanzanian black and olive baboon. We are going to see if we can... Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Wonderful. That was short and sweet, but we got to see him for a very brief second. So yeah, that was the Tanzanian black and olive baboon. And... That was wonderful. That was the first time he's actually came up and tongue fed for me. So yes, that was exciting. Let's move on. And I'm so sorry if I butchered that name. It's Insecratilla. It's one of those ones that's really hard for me to say. But yeah, that was an exciting takedown for me because it's the first time it's actually tongue fed. So yay. Okay, now I know I said this was going to be feeding only. But I came across, this is Chantico. Chantico is my Nandu Colorado Velosis who literally just molted. But I wanted to show you, you can see there's the legs and everything is still quite transparent. So I just thought I'd show you right fast, but we're going to leave this one alone. But look how beautiful. Okay, I took off the lid to find Amethyst, which is the Carabina Versicolor Sling. And as you can see, Amethyst is on the lid. So let's see if... Okay. Amethyst is going to take that down. Awesome. Well done, baby. Well done. Let's see if I can get it better. Out for you. There we go. Beautiful little baby. <laughs> Emma, this is so precious. Look at uh, there. Yummy, yummy little mealworm for the little baby. <laughs> okay, let's see who we can get next. Oh, I just could watch these little Carabina Versicolor slings all day. They're so cute. Okay, okay. Let's go to the next one. Okay, so next we have Patriot. This is a little Nandu Chromatis. And let's see if Patriot wants a mealworm. I guess so. Well, alrighty then. 
can't really see him now that he's under his enclosure. Or his, not his, his cork bark, but you saw he took it. So, <laughs> sometimes we can have, enjoy them, enjoy watching them feed, but sometimes they just take it right back under there. There's that booty. You gonna do a happy dance? <laughs> Good job, Patriot. Good job. Alright, let's move on. Okay, we all know who this is. This is Sapphire. This is my adult female Carabina Versicolor. And we all know she's going to eat. So I'm going to give her a super worm today. And see how she does. Oops. You j there you go. You got it, baby. You got it, baby. What a beauty. Look a there. Look a there. Her so beautiful. Yes, her he is. Her so beautiful. Another one, like, I tell you what, these Carabina Versa colors, I could just stare at them all day. I love the sling phase where there's such a cute little beautiful blue, and then the adult phase where they just look like purplish, reddish teddy bears. They're absolutely stunning. A green carapace. Okay, let's move on to the next one. Bye-bye, Sapphire. Oh. Okay, we all know who this is. This is my beautiful Grandma Stella Pulchra male Obsidian. Let's see if Obsidian wants to eat today. He didn't last time, so I don't know if he will this time. Whoops. Go, honey. Here, honey. Want it? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. It's another one that I'm just going to stick in here because he's so beautiful. Yes, him so beautiful. Look at that beautiful boy. Touch a sweetheart. Hi, honey. Hi, honey. Mommy loves you. Yes. <laughs> okay. I know, I know. I said it's a feeding video, but some of them... I'm still going to stick in here because they're so beautiful. Okay, let's move on. <laughs> okay, so next we have Merlot. This is one of my female deleted kettle wagons. Let's see if Merlot is hungry. <laughs> I guess so, huh? Look at that beautiful girl. Oh my goodness, look at that beautiful girl. How can people not like a tea wagons? Oh, sweet baby. Sweet baby. Alright. Okay, let's move on to the next one. Okay, and here is one of the hobby favorites. This is the Chromatopelma cyanue pubescence, also known as the Green Bottle Blue. This is Tulu. I'm sure Tulu will come out and get this large mealworm rather fast. So, let's see. See him creeping up. He's always been like that. They are beautiful, huh? They are beauties. He's like, take all the pictures you want. I'm beautiful. I'm not gonna go hide. It's like, I'm camera ready. 
Okay, Tulu. We have a lot of others to feed, so we'll catch you later, sweetie. Yes. Okay, let's move on to the next one. Okay, so next we have Spindel. Spindel is a Brachypelma Bomi. Okay, and she didn't take any time to uh, get that large mealworm. I accidentally dropped it out of the tongs, and uh, luckily I was filming because <laughs> I wasn't quite ready for that. But yeah, nice, fast takedown. Can't beat that. Look how stunning. These are our beautiful babies. My goodness, what a fast takedown. Good job, Spindale. Good job. Okay, let's move on to the next one. Next we have Diamante. This is the Pamphibedius Nagricolor. Let's see if Diamante will eat. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think that's a big yes. We just need to get the mealworm put right there. There we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Spastic little boogers, aren't they? <laughs> but yes, that is Diamante. Look at there, that beauty. Look at that beautiful baby. Alright, let's move on to the next one. Okay, next up we have the Pamphibedius Mascara. This is Maybelline. Let's give Maybelline a large mealworm. So let me catch one first. They're wiggly little boogers. This is going to be fun. Watch. Doop. Don't let it burrow. Get it, Maybelline. Can't let it burrow. Hey, eat it. Hmm. Must not like Maybelline did not eat. Okay. Just wanted it put right in front of her face. Somebody spoiled. I'll eat it if you put it right in front of my face. But I'm not going to walk to it. Ain't that right, Maybelline? See that vermiculite on her carapace? What a beauty. Yes. Oh my goodness. What a spoiled little pantho. Yes, you are. <laughs> You're so spoiled. Look at they are. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, so Coco is out. That is the Aphonopelma calcotes, also known as the Arizona Blonde. Let's see if she wants. Here you go. Good job, sweetie. See how gentle. Such beautiful, gentle babies. Oh my goodness, she's a nice mealworm, honey. Yes, she usually stays deep down in there. It actually goes there and then, and then underneath there the way she's got it. But she'll come out when she's hungry. But yeah, that is Coco, my beautiful adult female Aphonopelma calcotes. What a beauty. Okay, let's see who's next. Okay, so next we have another hobby favorite. This is the Brachypelma homori, also known as the Mexican Red Knee. This is the one you see in films a lot. This one's name is Indy. Indy never disappoints when it comes to eating. So let's see what he thinks of a large mealworm. 
Always such been such a good eater for me. Yes, what a beauty. Hello, Indy. Hello, Indy. There we are. There's that beautiful baby. Okay, let's move on to the next one. Okay, and here we have Rose. Rose is my mature male Nandu Chromatis. Let's see if Rose will eat today. Well done, buddy. Oops. Mommy dropped the tongs. Did you miss it, honey? You missed it? It's right there. You can get it. You can get it. There you go, sweetie. You got it. Good boy. What a sweet boy. Yes. Yes. What a sweet boy. <laughs> okay, Rose. We're going to move on. You enjoy that mealworm, baby boy. You enjoy that mealworm, honey. Okay, and I just missed that. This is Cerulean. This is my Linotheli species Panama. Cerulean has been eating mealworms here lately. So I figured we give Cerulean a cricket. But yes, that is my Linotheli species Panama. Such a beauty. I love Linothelis. I want more of these babies. But yeah, look at there. Just look how gorgeous. Alright, we're going to move on to the next one. Enjoy that, Cerulean. Say go, will, Mom. Okay, so this is Princess, my 24-year-old Grandma Stella Porteri. Let's... She loves crickets, so let me catch her a cricket. If I can, there we go. Let's see. Here you go, baby. Good job. Good job. What a beauty. What a beauty. What a beauty. There she is. A little bit of water on her booty. All right. Okay, so everyone should know who this is by now. This is Luna. This is my female Lassidor Pear Havana. She is a sassy one. Okay, well, let me have the tongs. It's right here, honey. Right here you go. Ready? Up, up, up. Here she goes. Are you going to get it? No? Are you going to get it, pretty girl? Huh? You're not going to let it dig, are you? Here. Get it. to say I just don't believe that Prince I mean not Princess Luna's not gonna eat. There we go. There we go. I was like that's not normal if she don't eat. 
There you go, beautiful girl. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's move on to the next one. Okay, and here we have Nico. Watch, sorry about that. Which is the Toledo cattle albopolosis confirmed female. Let's see if Nico is going to have a bite to eat tonight. And there she goes. <laughs> Good job, beautiful girl. Yes, her loves her green igloo. Yes, her loves her green igloo. Yes, she does. She loves it so much. <laughs> okay, let's move on to the next one. Okay, so next we have the Sarita Jars Darlingi, also known as the Rear Horn Baboon. This is Booger. <laughs> there you go good job booger what a beauty what a beauty oh so sweet yes you are you're so sweet oh my goodness look at there that's a yummy mealworm. That's a yummy mealworm. Yes, it is. <laughs> okay. We'll leave Booger alone and see how many we have left to eat. Bye-bye, Booger. Okay, everyone should know this one by now. This is Belle. My grandma stole a poker piece. Wanting to go out for a walk on Mommy today. But... Are you hungry? Are you hungry? Hmm? Does my sweet, my sweet boy want to eat? Like, no, Mom, I want to go for a walk. No, Mom, I want to go for a walk. I'm not hungry. I don't believe Bill's hungry. Bill just wants to go for a walk. See, I'm a little puppy dog. I like to go for walks on mommy sometimes. What a beauty. Alright. I know Bill didn't eat, but we're going to put Bill in the video anyway because you such a sweet baby boy. So beautiful. So beautiful. Just want to come out for a walk. Okay, as you can see, this is a Toledo Cattle Wagons mature male. This is Maori. You can see Maori's, you know, towards the end of his lifespan by looking at that booty and all. But let's, let's, we can always say, there we go. Good job, bud. Good job. There for the longest time, he wouldn't eat or drink, so I'm glad to see He's decided to eat some more. But yeah. That's Maori. And if you're wondering, that bald spot on the booty is from... Once they mature out, all they do is wander around looking for females. They just want to mate. So they worry themselves. Flick hairs constantly move around um, looking for a female. So that's what that's about. But yeah. That is a mature male Toledo Cattle Wagons, Maori. Okay, y'all, so I hope you enjoyed the video. We had a lot that ate, a lot that didn't. So, but yes, we literally went through every single spider. And so I hope this was enjoyable for you. Hope you all have a great morning, evening, or afternoon. Wherever you're at, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.